Learn how to speak Korean source. How to studa Korean.com. Below is a list of Korean vocabulary with English meaning, pronunciation, common usages and examples. Nouns. 눈썹 equal eyebrow. Common usages. 속 눈썹 equal eyelashes. Example. 그 사람의 눈썹은 짙어요. That person's eyebrows are thick. 교사 equal teacher. Notes. 교사. Refers more to the position of a teacher. You would usually refer to a teacher by calling him her. 선생님. However, if you wanted to tell somebody what your position was, you could use. 교사 선생님. Would also work here as well. Example. 저는 영어 교사예요. I am an English teacher. 반. Class of students in school. Common usages. 우리 반. Our class 2. 학년 3반. 클래스 2, 3 반장. Class president. Example. 몇 반이에요? What class are you in? 직장. Location of work. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 직장. Notes. In English, we say work to refer to what is being done and where it is being done. For example, I am doing work at work. 직장. Refers to the location in which you work. Example. 그는 직장에서 일찍 퇴근했어요. He left work early. 벽 equal 월. Common usages. 벽지, 월페이퍼 절벽, 클리프 벽에 기대다. To lean against a wall. Examples. 저는 사진을 벽에 걸었어요. I hung a picture on a wall. 그림은 벽에 걸려 있어요. The picture is hanging on the wall. 털. Hair, not on head. Fur. Common usages. 코털. Nose hair. 깃털 equal 패더즈. Notes. In English, we say hair for all of the hair on our body. However, in Korean, 털 is used to refer to any hair that is not on your head. It is also used to refer to the fur of an animal. Example. 저는 팔에 털이 많아요. I have a lot of hair on my arms. 머리카락. Hair. On head. Example. 그 여자의 머리카락은 길어요. That girl's hair is long. 저녁. Dinner. Evening. Notes. The word. 저녁. Can refer to the evening time, or the meal that is eaten at that time. Dinner. To distinguish between them. 저녁 식사. Dinner. And. 저녁 시간. The evening. Can also be used. Examples. 저녁으로 뭐 먹었어요? What did you eat for dinner? 엄마가 온 후에 저는 저녁 식사를 먹을 거예요. After mom comes home. I will eat dinner. 요리사들은 저녁을 부엌에서 준비했어요. The chefs prepared the dinner in the kitchen. 저는 저녁에 공부했어요. I studied in the evening. 저는 일요일에 저녁을 안 먹었어요. I didn't eat dinner on Sunday. 점심. Lunch. Noonish. Notes. The word. 점심. Can refer to the time around noon, or the meal that is eaten at that time. Lunch. To distinguish between them. 점심 식사. Lunch. And. 점심 시간. Noonish. Can also be used. Examples. 점심으로 뭐 먹고 싶어요? What do you want to eat for lunch? 저는 보통 점심 식사로 과일만 먹어요. I usually only eat fruit for lunch. 점심은 어땠어요? How is lunch? 점심을 먹었어. Did you eat lunch? 오빠는 바닥에 앉아서 점심을 먹었어요. My brother ate lunch sitting on the floor. 옷 equal clothes. Common usages. 옷을 입다. To put on clothes. 옷을 벗다. To take off clothes. 옷을 벗기다. To take clothes off of another person. 옷을 갈아입다. To change clothes. 비옷. Rain clothes. 겉옷. Some kind of outer clothing. Notes. One way and one form of telling somebody to put on clothes is to say. 옷 입어. This sounds like. 옷 입어. 이그젠펄즈. 저는 저의 옷을 벗었어요. I took off my clothes. 저는 자주 옷을 충동적으로 사요. I often buy clothes impulsively. 저는 따뜻한 옷을 입고 싶어요. I want to wear, put on, warm clothes. 옷을 갈아입으러 탈의실에 갔어요. He went to the change room to change his clothes. 여행할 때 옷을 많이 챙길 필요가 없어요. I you don't need to pack a lot of clothes when you travel. 우리가 똑같은 옷을 입고 있어요. 
We are wearing exactly the same clothes. Verbs. 찾다. To search for, find. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 찾다. Notes. In English, the words looking for searching and find have a similar meaning but are used differently. We use find after something is found. However, before something is found we use look for search. In Korean, the 찾다 is used for both of these usages. This confusion often leads Korean people to incorrectly say things like I am finding my brother. Examples 저는 저의 지갑을 찾고 있어요. I am looking for my wallet. 누군가는 너를 찾고 있어. Somebody is looking for you. 저는 그 사실을 백과사전에 찾았어요. I looked up the fact in an encyclopedia. 우리 회사는 새로운 회사원을 찾고 있어요. Our company is looking for new workers. 가르치다. To teach. Common usages. 수업을 가르치다. To teach a class. 학생을 가르치다. To teach a student. Examples. 저는 고등학교에서 10년 동안 영어를 가르쳤어요. I taught English at a high school for 10 years. 저는 학생들한테 한국어를 가르쳤어요. I taught Korean to the students. 어제 학생들한테 뭐 가르쳤어요? What did you teach the students yesterday? 저는 선생님이 그것을 언제 가르쳤는지 기억 안 나요. I don't remember when the teacher taught that. 선생님은 우리를 너무 잘 가르치셨어. Our teacher taught us really well. 이것을 가르쳐 줘서 감사합니다. Thanks for teaching that to me. 그 선생님은 한국어를 저에게 가르쳐 줬어요. That teacher taught me Korean. 일하다. To work. Notes. The noun form of. 일하다 일. Literally means work, as in, something you need to do. However, it is often used to refer to a task or anything that needs to be done. For example. 저는 내일 할 일이 있어요. I have something I need to do tomorrow. Examples. 저는 그 회사에서 일해요. I work it for that company. 저는 지난 월요일에 일했어요. I worked last Monday. 저는 2주 동안 열심히 일했어요. I worked hard for two weeks. 저는 그 회사에서 5월까지 일할 거예요. I will work at that company until May. 저는 회사를 위해 열심히 일할 거예요. I will work hard for the company. 아버지는 지금 일하고 있어요. Dad is working now. 그 사람은 10년 동안 열심히 일하고 부자가 되었어요. That person worked hard for 10 years and then became a rich person. 짓다. To build. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 짓다. 짓다. Follows the. 시옷. Irregular. Common usages. 집을 짓다. To build a house. Examples. 그 집을 언제 지었어요? When did you build that house? 저는 집을 지었어요. I built a house. 저는 우리 집을 나무로 지었어요. I built our house out of wood. 가지다. To own, to possess, common usages. 가지고 있다. To have, notes, when you use. 있다. To indicate that you have something, you must put the particle. 이가. On the object you have, for example. 저는 펜이 있어요. However, you can attach. 을. To that object if you use. 가지고 있다 갔다. Is a shortened version of this word. See lesson 97 for more information. Example. 저는 펜을 가지고 있어요. I have a pen. 잠그다. To lock. 잠그다. Follows the. 으. Irregular. Common usages. 수도꼭지를 잠그다. To turn the water. From a tap, off, example. 저는 문을 잠갔어요. I locked the door. 아버지는 창문을 잠갔어요. Dad locked the window. 있다. To forget. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 있다. Common usages. 잊어버리다. To forget. Notes. 아, 어버리다. Is added to some verbs to express the emotion that something was done and thrown away at the same time. It is commonly attached to. 있다. To express that something was forgotten and thrown away. Example. 저를 잊지 마세요. Don't forget me. 저는 아빠의 죽음을 잊지 않았어요. I didn't forget the death of my father. 열쇠를 어디 둔지 잊어버렸어요. I forget where I put my keys. 돕다. To help. 돕다. 
is an irregular. Hmm. Irregular. Hmm. Changes to o. when o. is added. However, hmm. changes to o. when any other vowel is added. Common usages. 도와주다. To give help. Notes. 아어주다. Is commonly added to this word, because usually when one helps somebody, it is a form of giving. Example. 도와주세요. Help me please. 주다. To give. When giving something to a person who deserves respect. 드리다. Is used. Notes. Often conjugated in the imperative voice. For example. 세요. To ask for something. For example. 밥을 많이 주세요. Give me lots of rice. Often gets placed after a verb if somebody does an action for somebody. For example. 이것을 만들어 주세요. Please, make this for me. See lesson 41 for more information. Examples. 그 그릇을 주세요. Give me that bowl, please. 밥을 사 주세요. Buy me food, please. 어머님은 너에게 돈을 줬어. Did your mother give you money? 저는 저의 친구에게 돈을 줬어요. I gave my friend money. 아빠는 나에게 음식을 줬어. Dad gave me food. 그 선생님은 한국어를 저에게 가르쳐 줬어요. That teacher taught me Korean. 맞다. To be correct. Common usages. 입맛에 맞다. To fit one's taste in food. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 맞다. Notes. In every way. 맞다 룩스. Feels and sounds like an adjective. However, in Korean. 맞다. Is a verb. In most cases this is irrelevant. But keep this in mind when conjugating. Example. 선생님, 이거 맞아요. Teacher, is this correct? 고객님들은 항상 맞아요. The customer is. Customers are. Always right. 이 자세 맞아요. Is this posture right correct? 그 학설은 맞을 리가 없어요. That theory cannot be right. Adjectives. 쉽다. To be easy. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 쉽다. 쉽다. Follows the. Few. Irregular. Examples. 그 일은 너무 쉬웠어요. That task was very easy. 저는 쉬운 일을 했어요. I did easy work. 누구나 그 쉬운 일을 잘 해요. Anybody can do that easy job well. 덥다. To be hot. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 덥다. 덥다 팔로즈. This. Few. Irregular. Common usages. 날씨가 덥다. The weather is hot. Notes. 덥다. Is only used to talk about the weather or one's body, not the temperature of objects. Examples. 오늘 날씨가 너무 더워요. Today the weather is too hot. 오늘은 어제보다 더 더워. Today is hotter than yesterday. 너무 더워서 창문을 열었어요. I opened a window because it is too hot. 그립다. To miss a thing. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 그립다. 그립다. Follows this. Few. Irregular. Notes. 보고 싶다. Can is used when one misses a person. In English to miss is a verb. 그립다. Is an adjective in Korean that describes the feeling that is felt when one misses something. It is more commonly used when one misses a non-person. As an adjective, it must get treated as one. Therefore, in order to say that one misses something, it is commonly used in the subject. Object. Adjective form that is taught in lesson 15. Example. 저는 우리 학교가 그리워요. I miss our school. 저는 한국 음식이 그리워요. I miss Korean food. 귀엽다. To be cute. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 귀엽다. 귀엽다 팔로즈. This. Cute. Irregular. Common usages. 귀여운 여자. Cute girl. Examples. 저의 여자친구는 너무 귀여워요. My girlfriend is very cute. 그 여자는 귀여워요. That girl is cute. 저는 귀여운 여자를 좋아해요. I like cute girls. 그 강아지의 꼬리는 아주 귀여워요. That puppy's tail is very cute. 춥다. To be cold. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 춥다. 춥다. Follows this. Cute. Irregular. Common usages. 날씨가 춥다. The weather is cold. Notes. 춥다. 
is only used to talk about the weather or one's body, not the temperature of objects. Examples. Canada is a cold country. Canada is a cold country in the winter. The weather got cold over the weekend. I don't like winter because it is too cold. The present recent weather is colder than normal. Lately, the weather is getting gradually colder. The weather is cold, so I put on warm clothes. 어렵다. To be difficult. 어렵다. Follows the. Pew. Irregular. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 어렵다. Common usages. 어려운 문제. Difficult problem. Examples. 수학은 너무 어려워요. Math is too difficult. 한국에서 대학교는 고등학교보다 덜 어려워요. In Korea, university is not as hard as high school. 저는 어려운 내용을 천천히 설명했어요. I explained the difficult content slowly. 부장님을 만족시키는 것은 어려워요. As it is difficult to satisfy our boss. 고등학교는 한국에서 어려워요. High school is difficult in Korea. 더럽다. To be dirty. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 더럽다, 더럽다. Follows the. Pew. Irregular. Example. 우리 집은 지금 매우 더러워요. Our house is really dirty right now. 쥐는 너무 더러워요. Rats are very dirty. 바쁘다. To be busy. 바쁘다. Follows the. Ooh. Irregular. Example. 제가 너무 바빠서 내일 못 가요. I can't go tomorrow because I am so busy. 저는 어제 너무 바빴어요. I was very too busy yesterday. 같다. To be the same. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 같다. Common usages. 읽어 같다. Grammatical principle. Introduced in lesson 35. 똑같다. Exactly the same. Notes. See lesson 15 for more information. Example. 저는 같은 바지가 있어요. I have the same pants. 캐나다 사람들은 한국 사람들과 같아요. Canadian people are the same as Korean people. 이 학교는 우리 학교와 같아요. This school and our school are the same. 저 식당은 이 식당과 같아요. That restaurant is the same as this one. 우리 아빠는 저것을 싫어할 것 같아요. Dad will probably not like that. 선생님이 그 수업을 하지 않을 것 같아요. The teacher probably won't teach that lesson. 안전하다. To be safe. Examples. 이 직업은 안전해서 좋아요. This job is good because it is safe. 저는 거리를 안전하게 건넜어요. I crossed the street safely. 우리 아버지는 차를 항상 안전하게 운전해요. Our dad always drives his car safely. 딱딱하다. To be hard. To be rigid. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 딱딱하다. 이 그잼플. 이 빵은 너무 딱딱해요. This bread is too hard. 다이아몬드는 딱딱하다. Diamonds are hard. 부드럽다. To be soft. The pronunciation of this word is closer to. 부드럽다. 부드럽다. Follows the. Pew. Irregular. Example. 그녀의 손은 부드러워요. Her hands are very soft. 그 여자의 피부가 너무 부드러워요. That girl's skin is very smooth soft. 손이 부드럽지 않아서 로션을 발랐어요. I put lotion on my hands because they weren't soft. 가능하다. To be possible. Example. 그것이 가능하다고 생각해요. Do you think that is possible? 불가능하다. To be impossible. Example. 그것을 움직이는 것이 불가능해요. It is impossible to move that. Adverbs. 일찍 equal early. Notes. 일찍. Is an adverb. The opposite of early is typically. 늦다. Which is an adjective. 늦게. Can be used as the adverb to have the meaning of late. For example, 우리는 일찍 도착했어요. We arrived early. 우리는 늦게 도착했어요. We arrived late. It would be awkward to say lately in English. Examples. 우리는 내일 일찍 일어나야 돼요. We need to wake up early tomorrow morning. 왜 이렇게 일찍 가요? Why are you going so early, like this? 제가 일찍 가도 돼요. 
May I go early? 저는 아침에 일찍 일어났어요. I woke up early in the morning. 그는 직장에서 일찍 퇴근했어요. He left work early. 밖에 일찍 나가려고 숙제를 빨리 했어요. I did my homework fast in order to go out early. 오전, morning. Notes. This generally refers to any time before noon, but to refer to specifically refer to something early in the morning. 새벽. Can be used. Left double quotation mark. 아침. Refers to the time from breakfast until around noon. Example. 저는 내일 오전에 교회에 가야 돼요. I have to go to church tomorrow in the morning. 오후 equal left noon. Notes. To refer to a time later than 5 o'clock or so. 밤. Or. 저녁. Would more commonly be used. Example. 오후에 뭐할 거예요? What are you doing in the afternoon? 저는 오늘 오후에 낮잠을 잤어요. I took a nap in the afternoon today. 매일 equal every day examples. 저는 매일 운동하겠습니다. Equal. I will exercise every day. 저는 매일 운동해요. I exercise every day. 매일 같은 운동을 하지 말고 많이 쉬세요. Don't do the same exercise every day and get lots of rest. 그 남자는 매일 까만색 옷을 입어요. That man wears black clothes every day. 저는 공휴일을 빼고 매일 일해요. I work every day except for public holidays. 저의 엄마는 매일 운동해요. My mother exercises every day. 여름, summer. Common usages. 여름 방학. Summer vacation. Notes. For more information, words and sentences about seasons check out our weather theme lesson. Examples. 이번 여름은 너무 더워요. This summer is too hot. 여름에 저는 공부하겠어요. I will study in the summer. 가을, cool example. 가을이 시원해서 좋아요. Fall is nice because it is cool. 가을의 잎의 색깔은 변해요. The color of the leaves changes in the fall. 겨울 equal winter. Common usages. 겨울 방학. Winter vacation. 겨울잠, hibernation example. 너무 추워서 저는 겨울이 싫어요. I don't like winter because it is too cold. 캐나다는 겨울이 추운 나라예요. Canada is a country of with cold winters. 겨울에 한국 사람들이 문을 왜안 닫는지 이해가 안 돼요. I don't understand why Korean people don't close the door in the winter. 피부가 너무 약해서 겨울에도 로션을 발라야 돼요. I even need to add on lotion in the winter because my skin is weak. 봄, 스프링 이그잼플, 나무는 봄에 예뻐요. The trees are pretty in spring. 한국에는 황사가 중국에서 봄마다 와요. Yellow dust comes to Korea every spring from China. 봄에는 꽃가루 알레르기를 조심해야 해요. You need to be careful about pollen allergies in the spring. For more info, please visit howtostudacorean.com.